the 1st of May 2021. Today is the day when the state of West Bengal has imposed restrictions like lockdown. It's not exactly a lockdown, but the restrictions are somewhat like that. I know that the kitchen is looking really messy right now. It's because, you know, my house is under construction. And this used to be a kitchen literally like 15 years back. And this was all given for rent. And until our new kitchen is done, we will be using this place as a kitchen once again. And before this, we used to use this place like a go down. We used to store the goods of our store out here. And when I told you lockdown like restrictions, it means that every day, starting from today that is the first of may the market shall only be open from 7 a.m in the morning till 10 p 10 a.m in the morning and in the evening from 3 to 5 p.m and places of gatherings like movie theaters gyms pubs, everything's gonna be closed and i just thought since we have to stay at home we have to create content right i have to create some of the lifestyle vlog of mine i just can't go on traveling and cre creating my regular travel vlogs like i want to do but even while staying at home, I can create really good content, my really good lifestyle vlogs starting from today. Um, I don't think I'll be able to create every new vlog every single day, but I'm gonna try to at least upload a vlog in two or three days at the most. So in today's vlog, I'm gonna be teaching you how to make really good chicken at your place and well, impress your mom or your girlfriend or your dad or whoever you want to impress. So without wasting much time, let's get into the vlog. So before cooking something, what we need to do is we need to wash this because I need to wash chicken and the easiest way to wash chicken I feel is not inside the plate but right under the tap and sometimes on the basin itself. Yes, most vloggers don't show this, I'm pretty sure but I don't really show this in front of the camera but this is the kind of stuff that I do at home as well. My mom's favorite dialogue, you know what? Whenever I used to be a small kid, when I used to be a small kid, uh, when she had to make me do something, she used to tell me, Sora banim, sorry banim, toi to. Basically, it means that you are our son as well as you are our daughter. So you need to do everything on your own. There's no one who's gonna do it for you. After this, I need to clean the chicken and then I need to marinate the chicken and well, I need to cook it. I'm multi-talented, you see bro? I'm multi-talented. I can wash the dishes, I can cook, I can edit this video, see? So I'm done with washing the kebanjarai, karai. The pan or whatever you want to call it in English. Now it's time for me to wash the chicken. Here's the chicken. And the reason why I don't need to cook for that today is my dad is not at home. He has gone to his friend's daughter's wedding. So once you're done cleaning the chicken, just drain the excessive water out. And clean the sink. Because if you don't clean the sink right now, it will leave some very bad stains in the sink. And later on what you need to do is, you need to rub it really hard with a brush like this. With a jute or whatever you want to call it. Now, we are going to marinate it. And you know what is the best part about owning a store? Hang on, mate, I'm gonna tell you. So the good thing about owning a store is you never run out of essentials. Like now, I need a lemon and we have it in a store. It's so simple, mate. I need this to marinate the chicken. Here is my chicken, here is my lemon. Apart from this, we'll be needing turmeric, that is haldi. We'll be needing a bit of red chilli powder out here. We'll be needing ginger garlic paste. Well, I don't like to use ginger garlic paste. What I prefer to do is to piecing the, <laughs> to grind the 
raw ginger and garlic. I don't like to use the packaged one. I feel like it doesn't give the real taste of ginger and garlic. And apart from that, we need to add a bit of salt as well. So first, let me get done with ginger garlic. I need to get the ginger and garlic ready. Bro, I'm so excited to make a vlog at home. I don't know why. This is the need of the hour actually. Creators like us, we need to stay indoors, we need to stay safe. Not just creators like us, viewers like you as well. You need to stay indoors, stay safe, take care of your family. And during times like this, spend time with your family and get to know them better. It's because in today's world, we are so occupied in our own lives that we often forget how our family members are doing as well. So this is a perfect opportunity for us to, you know, get, get to know them better, talk to them properly. And let's just hope and pray that whatever we are going through right now, this entire global pandemic, all of us, that is the entire world, we get to hear this good news that the pandemic has been over. Let's hope and pray that that day comes soon. Because you and I, you're obviously watching me with the help of a cell phone. That means you're actually quite well to do compared to some other people who are staying hungry, who don't even have proper food to eat. So we are very fortunate, you know, because we have shelter. We have homes as a shelter. We have food to eat. We don't have to go to sleep hungry. We haven't seen those days. So consider yourself very fortunate that you have your food on the table, you have your place, your house, your bed to sleep, you have your family to talk to. Consider yourself very fortunate. Not everyone has that. This vlog was supposed to be a very hasmuk one, a very jolly one, but I got a bit serious midway, right? But that's the truth actually. And now I won't be very serious. I'll just continue with my regular chicken vlog. <laughs> chicken vlog? Seriously, bruh? Me mom, where she? I don't know, bruh. Whenever you go outside, always wear a good quality mask. Always do. If you wear a surgical mask, Make sure that you wear at least two masks. One surgical mask on the inside and on the outside, a regular mask which will keep your surgical mask tied to your face. Don't just use a surgical mask and be like, oh, I'm using a mask, I won't get COVID-19. It's already 2021 and COVID-19 is still not over. It's already been two years. This is the second year. Just wait and watch, bro. My mom's gonna love this chicken. And if you cook this for your family when you're staying at home, when this lockdown happened, then I'm sure your family is gonna be very proud of you as well. Even if you have never cooked in your entire life, just try it once. Even if you don't make it really tasty, but your parents are gonna be very proud of you for trying. They're gonna be very emotional. Because in the end, it's the effort that counts. Nothing is more beautiful than someone giving you their time and effort. And for parents, when the kids do that for them, there's no moment of happiness bigger than that. Now they are nicely grind. So what I'm gonna do right now is take a little bit of this and put it on the chicken for marination. The reason why I'm keeping this much for now is I need this in the curry as well. 
So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna clean this grinder, the stone. Now in this chicken, I need to cut this thing off. A bit of turmeric, as I told you earlier. Turmeric. A bit of red chili powder. Red chili powder. A bit chicken masala. A bit of salt. Doing some mommy, I'm If you have curd available at your place, curd, a bit of it. Good, and then lemon. Half a lemon will do. Now you have to mash it up like this so that equal quantity of all the spices get to all the pieces of chicken smells really good bro smells really good and we are gonna leave this for 10 to 15 minutes and meanwhile I'm gonna slice the onion and tomato and apart from that we aren't gonna be using any spices to slice them And I'm gonna take this and this plate, the sliced onions and keep it out here. And the tomato, I'm gonna keep it out here because after this, I don't need to cut any other thing. And why would I even care to make another utensil dirty when I have to wash it in the end? Jugaad. <laughs> and it's always easier to cut tomato from this side and not from here for now I'm gonna keep it somewhere out here because first I need to fry this thing and in that oil itself I'm gonna cook this thing I want to chicken I want to eat I want to eat I want to eat I I so the first rule whenever you fry chicken or whenever you cook any meat never use soya bean oil the taste of the meat comes better with mustard oil so this is the mustard oil. <laughs> Look at the soya bean oil cup bottle. <laughs> it looks like an old man. Dark humor. Just warm the pan for a while. Just warm it for a while. And then pour some oil. Now let the oil get heated up nicely. Else if the oil is not heated up properly, then what is gonna happen is your chicken is gonna stick to the 
base of your utensil of your pan rotate it like this like this make the entire part of your pan or your utensil slippery with oil and 10 15 minutes later the marinated chicken just smells amazing now just put it put it in the oil and fry it What you need to do right now is you need to deep fry the chicken. And once you are done with deep frying the chicken, just take it out on a plate like this. And then you need to deep fry the other set as well. I know I can cook, bro. Can you do that? I'm sure you can, right? After watching this video tutorial, you can cook just as good as me, if not better. I'm actually very hyped today. I don't know the reason why I'm so hyped. I'm so energetic. I'm so enthusiastic. I don't know. I just am feeling happy. I know I suck at dancing, bro. I can't help it. Once the chicken turns this color, you can remove the chicken from the pan. And I'm gonna keep this marinated residue, which I'm gonna add in the curry later on. Let me just take a small bite of the chicken and see how it tastes. Trust me bro, it's really good. It's so soft and so tender. Really nice. Taking the chicken out of the pan. So the first thing that you need to put in your pan full of oil is onion. And fry the onions until they are slight golden in color. Golden or reddish or whatever you want to call it. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put tomatoes out here. I'm gonna wash this as well. Did you notice that whenever I finish using a particular utensil, I just wash it and keep it aside. That helps in keeping the place at least a bit organized and in the end it helps me wash less dishes. Because washing one or two plates at once, it's not a big deal, right? But if you have to wash 20 at the same time, you're gonna get bored. So, jugad bro, jugad. Now, the time for ginger and garlic paste. Add this residue that was left after marination. Now the final procedure is to add this chicken in the curry and let and let it cook for at least 10 minutes. Let it warm properly. The rice is still not done. But I'm gonna see you folks directly during lunch time now. Bye! Ciao! Here is a Lucy! Lucy the cat! Do you think she's a dog? No, she's not a dog. She kills mice. Rats. So, she's a cat in the face of a dog. And what is a face? It's appearance. From the inside, she was born to be a cat. But then, she was born in a dog's body. But she's a cat because she loves to kill rats. So just finished washing the dishes and well, let's ask mom how she liked the chicken or not. Mom, what is chicken? Mom, what is it? 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 If the marks would have been around 9, then it would have been good. But she told it's just 7. I'm going to go to the bathroom. I'm going to go to the bathroom. I'm going to go to the bathroom. Drinks. 
So anyways, this was entirely about my today's vlog. I really hope that you folks enjoyed. And until next time, this is your brother, the vlogger from the Hills, Priyam Gurung. And I'm, and I will see you very, very soon. Till then, take care, bye bye, and cheers to life. Thank you so much. And Lucy is also enjoying the chicken and rice. Lucy, how many members are there? One day in ten months. Ten members, put your hand up. Oh, Lucy. Oh, ten members. Now she is rating my chicken a full ten. Ciao.